What's going on, y'all? What good with it, man? Uh, I'm just gonna do something a little different today. I guess I'm gonna just take take y'all with me along. You know what I'm saying? What I'm doing there, everything. Got some, I got some packages to drop off. I gotta go pick up jogging suits and stuff like that. Um, and it's a reason for uh, me picking up the jogging suits. And I get into that. Um, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna just talk to y'all and show y'all what I'm doing throughout the whole day and stuff like that. I'm about to switch it up a little bit with the content, man. Hopefully, y'all rock with it. If y'all don't, just watch the next video. You know what I'm saying? So, hey, let's get it. So, right now, um, like I just said, I'm about to go to um, the place where I pick up my clothes and stuff like that. Uh, my blanks. Uh, for y'all know I, you know, customize clothing and stuff like that, and I actually have my own brand. And now I'm at the turning point where I realize, like, me supporting other brands that aren't um, like my friends or you know what I'm saying, people that I associate with and stuff like that, it's really not, it's not gonna further me. You know what I'm saying? So right now, what I'm doing is I'm about to just basically get rid of most of my stuff that isn't my brand. You know what I'm saying? So. All I'm at this point trying to do is wear my brand every time I step out the house. Something that I have on, like this flannel, you know what I'm saying? That's me, you know what I'm saying? All that kind of stuff. But I'm working on jogging suits, t shirts, all that kind of stuff. If y'all want to support me, definitely uh, hit me up on Instagram or something like that. I'm revamping my website and stuff like that. So you'll have to, you know, do all that. But I will be showing y'all the different uh, jogging suits that I just finished working on and stuff like that. So let's get into that. I'll meet y'all. When I meet y'all, enjoy the B-roll. You know, yeah. Okay, y'all. My bad, my bad. My, I honestly forgot to record yesterday, man. Um, you know, got busy, you know. But today we're gonna continue this thing. I'm finna go do shipping. Um, probably hit the mall. Um, look around, see what's in there, you know what I'm saying? Maybe get some inspiration or something like that. Uh finna get me some Chick-fil-A because I'm hungry in the mall of school. Do you feel me? And um, after we, after that, we got what not live tonight. All that kind of stuff. I'm working on some jogging suits. I just finished some hats and stuff like that. I'm gonna show y'all those. So uh, just roll with me, man. Hey y'all, so I just went in uh, Best Buy to see, I went in Best Buy to see uh, about some cameras and lenses and stuff like that. And uh, I need to ask y'all a favor. Hey man, make sure y'all watch the video all the way through. Make sure y'all watch the ads, all of that. Cause if I want to get me the, um, a 4K camera, y'all want the quality to be fine, you know what I'm saying? All that good stuff. Y'all gonna have to help a brother out. <laughs> Cause they want racks for them joints, man. I'm talking about my major, major chicken. You know what I mean? Not just for, you know, the body. Nah, the lenses. The lenses costing more than the doggone camera. You know what I'm saying? So, I'ma need y'all to, uh, yeah, man, help a brother out. Watch all the video, watch the ads. You know what I'm saying? Buy some merch. Pretty much anything that's gonna help me out. You know what I mean? Uh, let me get up with y'all though. It's, it's been, I've been so busy, man, during this time and stuff like that. It'd be hard for me to like to remember. I right, pick up the camera, pick up the camera, stuff like that. But man, right now I'm just getting ready to head out and run some more errands. Um, I already have ran some this morning. Y'all think? Check, check, check the fit, y'all. Should I go? You know, it's just a regular little jogging suit and stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? The cargo pocket and stuff like that. But should I go? My favorites. Bone, should I go with them or should we go with the customs? You know what I'm saying? Those light customs, you know what I mean? Just the road lay. You know what I'm saying? Boom, bye, y'all. I don't know. What what should we go with, y'all? I'm not. I mean, I kind of had the, the one set or whatever, but then, you know what I'm saying? I just ain't no break, you hear me? But man, anyway, man, I um, like I said, I've been real busy, man. You know, these times, times like this don't come around, like, 
all the time during the year, so you gotta press. And that's one thing, you know, I can uh, tell y'all, man. When it's good, you gotta strike while the iron hot, you know what I'm saying? And uh, make sure, make sure you stash your little something, you know what I mean? Like, when, when, when it's these times where everybody buying stuff and, you know, business going good and stuff like that, man, you gotta, you gotta prepare for the dry time, cause they on the way. I'm telling you, after after this time right here where everybody broke, those are the times where you know what I'm saying, you you gonna you're gonna get a little dry on you. I mean depending on who you are, you know. Some people will never dry up, but I'm speaking to those who, you know what I'm saying, uh of the majority, not the minority. Um gotta stash you a little something away. Make sure you're gonna be straight for a rainy day and all that kinds of stuff, man. And also have you something else. You know what I'm saying? That you can do in different avenues of waking, making bread and stuff like that. That's what I do. You know what I'm saying? Just, um, I know how to get it, man. I know how to pay these bills. One thing I can't do, you hear me? I can't do it all, but I can I can do something. I can pay these bills. I think I'm going to go with the ones. I don't feel like getting the white shoes dirty or nothing like that. So I'm going to go with these ones. I can clean these off real quick and stuff like that if I do get them dirty. So. We're going to go with the ones today, man. Uh, but I'm going to try to bring y'all along some more and stuff like that, man. I, I got to do better. I just got to do better. That's, I ain't going to make no excuses or nothing like that. I got to figure this thing out. I got to get better, man, for y'all. For my people, you hear me? Man, let go get this money, man. I need to tell y'all what I got going on right now. So, um, I just picked up a bunch of uh, materials. Cause I do, we gotta get some orders done, like clothing wise and stuff. Oh my goodness, I done stepped in the in the daylight. Ah Hold on y'all. But anyway, man, I um just finished going to our local little vinyl and t-shirt type of store. Gotta get some t-shirts done. Uh, a couple Christmas shirts, a couple uh things like young boys joints, uh little baby, uh gotta do some hoodies, all that different kinds of stuff. Um then I gotta go to finish line, gotta pick up a pair of forces, gotta do a rope lace, and all that good stuff, man. So I'm gonna try my best to bring y'all with me and all that. But um, you know, that's it, man. This the life, dog. Uh, they're gonna go get it. All right, now you can go ahead and teach me, bro. So just to let you know, you do not have my consent to record me. That's what's up. All right. So when you put this on the video, I want you to make sure that you Say that I explicitly stated that I did not want to be recorded. As uh, I was yeah. demonstrating how to make bandana rope lace for the first once. Mm -hmm. You gonna show me? We all need to learn. Mm. That's interesting, right there. Here we go. All right, Captain Shane, let's go. To protect the tongue, you wanna tuck and roll it. Tuck and roll. Just like this. That's right. I recommend that you don't scrunch it or anything like that because you do want to kind of keep the, the tongue nice and clean. I've seen other people, you know, kind of push it, shove it, tuck it, stuff like this. So far, this is the best way I feel to make sure that the tongue, once you pull it back out from drilling, is in a fairly decent position. But now that we have all of the... Uh, the tongue tucked into the shoe, we will begin drilling. I am working on a slightly smaller shoe. Um, and these can be a little bit tricky, but the key is we got our drill with our specialized drill bit here. Amazon, I'll put the affiliate links down below so that y'all can get this exact same thing. All of this was under $50, by the way. Um, but to put a consistent, nice little pressure in as we go in through the hole. about that uh as y'all see that hole right there is nice crisp and clean <laughs> and we went about to that mark right there to make sure that the rope lace can go through fairly nicely and then towards the end i'll get a vacuum and dust everything up you want to make sure you get all the dust up before you begin the glue process or you can have a lot of frizzes in your shoe and that's not going to look good but anyway, appreciate y'all for tuning by. I'm going to take the rest of this time to go ahead and drill the rest of these holes into the shoe. And then uh, start to put the rope laces in after we start to put the fabric on the shoe. You know you. 
Alright y'all, this is what we got going on right now. Just wrapping these up. I gotta go on here and take the gun, cut the excess uh rope off and everything. Same for these. I got two pair of the rope. Regular white rope. Oh my goodness. Rope lace joints. Then got two pair of these. Also gotta work on um some jokers and stuff like that. But uh um, then on top of that, I got to I gotta ship these off today. I already got the labels and everything. I gotta box them up, get them shipped out, wrap them out. That good kind of stuff. You feel what I'm saying? Then come back. Uh, I might go to Bass Pro because I might, I think I need to get some more hats for this live tomorrow. Yeah, I think I'm gonna do a live tomorrow. So get the hats and all that kind of stuff, man. Um, then I had other shoes to do. I, I got a lot to do, man. I told y'all, you know what I'm saying? I've been doing a lot and then in the process of moving and stuff like that. So it's been difficult on your back. You feel what I'm saying? But we're gonna get to it. It's raining. It's ugly. God. But anyway, man. Oh, we dark. We dark. Anyway, man, so. We're about to go ahead and head up to this post office and drop these packages off. I'm not looking forward to this because like y'all see, it's raining hard here, man. But we got to get to this chicken, you feel me? So let's eat. What's good, y'all? Right now, I'm, uh, dang, oh my goodness, I'm trying to continue my work. So I got a hat right now. I got to go ahead and bleach this real quick. There's a whole lot I got to do today. I go pick up shoes and all that kind of stuff. So I'm gonna get to this hat, show y'all how we get down real quick. I can't keep playing, you can't keep playing. Hold it out your hand, I pull the mission. Alright man, so I got that hat done. Now it's drying because I had to wash all the bleach out of stuff like that. So now it's time to prep these things up. I gotta have these done ASAP because this is a Christmas order. So let's get to it. Okay, we got these all prepped up now. We got them. This what is a nine. A nine right here. We gotta do this nine and a half now. Gonna get these prepped up, ready to paint, man. All right, y'all. Right now, I'm uh about to print this label off. About to look, man. About to print this label off, man. Got my card order, man. So this is I'm showing y'all, man. All the things I had to do during my business days and everything. So got the printer right. Oh, so now printer black. I'm, oh my goodness. Print black as a mold. Oh dang, I done made it even blacker. But yeah, man, y'all see. That way go, man. Now I'm finna get it done, man. Get it packed up and then sent out. Alright, y'all, so I just went to the uh, vinyl store to try to get these hoodies and, and shirts that I need, but they didn't have them. They were sold out. And then for one size, they don't even carry that, that size in the long sleeve, so. But if you ever in the Memphis area, um, this is Olive Branch, which is like literally the borderline, um, state line of Mississippi and Tennessee. So if you're ever in, in Memphis, the Memphis area, you need to go to a vinyl store to get t-shirts or whatever. This, the, oh my goodness. So this is the one I go to, hold on. It's called the Vinyl Room. There we go. So now we got to go to the next one uh which is vinyl depot so and that is uh basically on the other side of where i'm at right now so let's get to it bro 
Look at Stank, y'all. She take her driver's test. Look at him. Look at her Stank. Hey, Stank. Stank and drive, y'all. But she ain't driving my car. What is this? What's good, Wizzy? What's good with it, y'all, man? Today was a very special day. Lil' bro getting a new whip and all that kinds of stuff. So, man, I just finished washing that thing up for him and all that good kinds of stuff. And uh, I'm finna dress the tires and stuff like that. Uh, it's looking clean, man. I'm gonna give y'all some little bottle shots and everything. So, we're finna surprise him with this new car. Uh, definitely a guy who deserves it, man. Great kid, man. Good dude. Uh, working real hard in school and stuff like that. So when you work hard, you know what I'm saying, and you keep the Lord first. Oh yes, sir. Man, you deserve things, man. And he gonna give them to you. You feel me? So I'm gonna go ahead and handle this. Uh, gotta finish drying and everything, and then I'ma dress the tires. I'ma show y'all what they more looking like. You hear me? All right, y'all. So we finna get these tires right. Hold on, let me brighten it up a little bit. Oh no, I don't know where. Hold up, y'all. All right, there you go. Burn that. Get that nice. Get him right. Oh, he's gonna smell good, too. Look at the little, dang, little grass and stuff on the junk. But it's all good. Be all right. Looking good, bro. We got him pinged up. <laughs> Told y'all we gonna. Right, let, I'm gonna let this be the introduction <laughs> to the car content. This really ain't just car content. This kind of like some behind the scenes, you know, life of cadet type of stuff. But oh, my hair look a mess. I'm a I'm gonna make it a mission. I'm gonna cut my hair today, y'all. I don't care what go on. I actually gotta work and all that kind of stuff, but it don't matter. Man, I'm a little tired from that. I need to get back in that gym. Oh uh, yeah, video coming soon about that too. So yeah, all right, we finna see, uh, I guess, you know, when he pull up or whatever, we gonna see what the reaction and all that good stuff. You can't keep playing. Big Ace, what up, dude? <laughs> Ace, they done got me, man. What the? Happy birthday, Jay. No, oh, man, no. Birthday, no. Man. no. <laughs> Check it out, Ace.
Fan fan. Hey man, this is no nah. Fenn it with Winsky. Fenn it with Winsky. It's a wide body. You know, big bad. You know, yay, hog and lion, yeah. I tell you, the price just went up. Man, hey, look. Exponentially. Mm -hmm. Expeditiously. You hear me? How much for a feature? Man, I want a hundred thousand. I bet he had two hundred. Okay, two hundred each occasion. Mm. I, I, I done forgot the stuff. Are the keys in there? He just gave me. Yep. Right there. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Three point Sam. You know what I mean? You know, yeah. I think it's something like. Three, I think like 320 horsepower, something like that. Early, Come on, man. You know, I yeah. I thought I was dropping the Acura off to get a detail. You know, yeah. I done came home. Hey. I came down. Roll up. Man. Fanny McFanski. <laughs> Brother Fin Fan. Join your brothers in Memphis. Paper tags and infinities. Is it off? Yeah, it's off, man. <laughs> I don't need nothing for the next five years. <laughs> yeah, I do, though. I ain't gonna lie. I need something from you. Happy birthday, man. That's... Dang, that threw me off. Uh, you like it? Love it. <laughs> yeah, I want to do something special for you, man. You, you been working hard. Don't complain. You know, so you deserve it. Shoot, I was, that's crazy. I'm just sitting there telling myself, I'm like, dang, they give us the next check. I'm going to go ahead and get my road replaced. <laughs> Shoot, get them Man, let's go to the mall and ball out. Blow it all. You hear me? Everything. Every dollar. I'm talking about really going dead or something like that. Take out a... Uh, uh, uh. You want to take a ride in the field? Hey. Hey. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Buff guy growing a beard. Look. What? what? Yeah. I'm fat now. He thought he stopped being buff. <laughs> this guy's, I don't know. You don't have to be like 300 to stop being buff. Hey. Oh, Lord, I forgot I had a dog. Now I'm finna take y'all through my little struggle right now. Ain't no way for him. Shape or something. Form. Oh, my goodness. Ain't no way is this to brag. This to brag, man. I'm just showing y'all a little bit of, you know, my life and all that kind of stuff. And what I go through when I try to decide on what I'm finna wear. So I'm trying to pick out some shoes, you know. Little bro in town and stuff like that. So we finna step out a little bit. We finna hit the mall or whatever, right? Mind you, my hair looks awful. Um, terrible. But, um, I mean, I gotta do a little something, something. So that adds another element of, um... Uh, a challenge to my feet and all that kind of stuff. So I'm trying to pick out what shoes I'm finna wear because that's how I like to start mine off. I, I want to wear some new joints. Alright, y'all. So this is the dilemma I'm faced with. Not the dilemma. I wouldn't say that. 
This is the blessing that I'm faced with. I don't know which shoes I want to wear. Like I was saying, I want to wear something new, right? So, I don't know, man. Like, y'all, y'all let me know in the comments what y'all would have went with. I mean, of course, you know, y'all ain't here, so y'all can't really advise me like that. You know what I'm saying? Hold on. But, yeah, so, like, I just caught these guy right here. Color really ain't showing up like that. Hold on. Man. But the green ain't they, the color ain't really showing up like it's supposed to. But I just caught these right here. And I got I got a Miami um Hurricane baseball jersey. But I already, you know what I'm saying, got drippy in it one time and threw it on the ground. So I don't know, should we double back? You know what I'm saying? Then like I done had these since the summertime. And I really been itching to wear these guys. You hear me? But I really, to be honest, I ain't really got no fit for these. I mean, I could throw something together. You know, I'm really like that when it comes to like, you know what I'm saying, fashion stuff and all that. But I ain't really just got like the cause like with me, I like to have a fit set for when I make uh when I like wear a new shoe, you know what I'm saying, for the first time. I like to have a set fit in my mind and stuff like that. And I ain't really got one like this, so I don't know, man. But I do want to. I do want to wear these because I really like them. But then let me let me go back over here because I know. And then nah, I know I ain't trying to wear my cool gray, not yet. But then like I really, really been wanting to wear my Bo Jacksons, right? Cause like this is one of my favorite shoes of all time. I don't worry about that little seat in there. That for them taxes, y'all, you know. But, um, I really been wanting to wear these, bruh. But I ain't got no fit. Like like I just said, I ain't got no set fit I, got, I wanted to wear with them yet. You know what I'm saying? Like, dang, bruh. I really did have a fit, y'all. I had an orange jogging suit. But I didn't, br I ain't, I ain't uh, finished that jump. I ain't finished that junk yet. Dang, I could have really. I don't know. I'm keeping these in mind. I might still wear these. I might throw a fit together to, so I can wear these. I don't know. I'm keeping them in mind. And then on top of that, I got I got these junks. And I really been. I mean, y'all see how much I like them. I got two pair of them. But I really been wanting to wear these junks, bro. And then, like, I'm, I'm still kind of salty about not getting them lost and found. So, like. I still want to go and wear my little Constellation prize, you know what I'm saying? Even though these ain't these ain't that, but you know what I'm saying? These fight though, to me, in my opinion. But I'm going to make sure I get them uh, Chicago 2s, though, for sure, for sure. But I've been wanting to wear these, too. And I know, I mean, it's red, black, and white. Oh, I got something that, that can go fight with this. I know that. But I have been wanting to wear these, and I'm just not sure on if I want to wear them. Today or whatever, cause it's been so many times I done broke these out and ain't wear them. <laughs> like I done took these on trips and everything, still ain't wear them. Okay, y'all, I think I got it. I think I got it, man. Ah, uh, y'all know how I was telling y'all I done had these since like the summer. And I ain't been able to wear them and stuff. I just went through my stuff and I found a hoodie that matched perfectly with these junk, right? So one thing I like to do. When I'm when I'm getting dressed, I don't want I don't want it easy. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Like like that, that's one of our models around here. You know what I'm saying? We don't want nothing easy. So what I'm saying is the hoodie. You know what I'm saying? Match perfect. All right, but I'm gonna show y'all hoodie in a minute. It's all black and then it got like words on there that matches this color perfectly. But then I pulled out some black jeans and I'm like, I could do that. But that's too easy. I don't want it that easy. You feel me? That's that's how you has. You know what I'm saying? It's like when when the flavor there. You know what I mean? I could go with. You know what I'm saying? The little the little um the little Creole seasoning. But that's too easy. You feel me? I want to mix my own flavor in there. You know what I'm saying? I might take a little garlic powder, a little onion powder. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? A little a little, a little cayenne pepper. You feel me? I might throw a little a, a little brown sugar in that thing. Just you know what I'm saying? Like you can't have it too easy. You know what I mean? So I'm gonna show y'all what the fit gonna be like. You know, yeah, I'm, I'm I got I'm still struggling a little bit, but hey, we gonna figure it out. 
What's good with it, y'all? Your boy back in the building. I finally cut my hair, so I'm semi cute again. Not cute, semi. You feel me? Still a little ugly, but it's okay though. But right now, man, I'm gonna head this up to the um a few places. Actually, I'm finna give me something to eat first. This junk trip. Okay, so yeah, like I was saying, I'm finna head up to um few spots to get first I'm getting something to eat then I gotta go pick up materials and all that good kind of stuff man today is a pack day I gotta get shoes done shoes shipped all that good kind of stuff man and I gotta what not lie it's a very busy day man I think what I'm finna do is like make a doggone three hour long video for y'all <laughs> instead of dropping uh, on the daily because I just can't get to my computer and edit man but it's okay though. I'ma get right like Sprite on the Sunday night. You feel me? But um, gotta go pick up some jogging suits, hoodies, all kinds of different stuff, man. Then I gotta go pick up a cage for my brand new a baby rabbit. You feel what I'm saying? So uh, just follow the key. You hear me? Had to go get me some McGrubby McGrubsky. Oh, that firehouse. I'm finna fire this up, man. And you know what? Uh, yeah. Right, we're good y'all so right now finna head up in this little goodwill man to see if we can uh come up on a little cheap cage for the money you know what I'm saying? so we gonna see man one okay these 15 that's better I can't wait to get in the car so I can put some hand sanitizer on. <laughs> All right, y'all. So we ain't really find nothing in there, man. Uh, y'all saw the the forces well. Oh yeah, I, I, I put hand sanitizer already on and stuff like this. So when I touch my face, I'm clean. You feel me? But um. Yeah, man, they wanted they wanted too much for them uh, nasty forces in there, man. Twenty dollars, fifteen dollars, thirty dollars. Nah, bro, uh, uh. Them like legit need to be about four five dollars. You know what I'm saying? I would have scooped them up then. I would show y'all how to get that chicken up off them, but I ain't nah, heck nah, bro. Not 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 for that much. But we finna go on ahead to the uh, pick these hoodies up and stuff like that and jogging suits and stuff. Uh, it's pretty early in the morning, man. But I gotta get to it. Um, I actually finished one pair of shoes. I ain't even show it, man. So peace. Uh, finished one pair of shoes. Dropped them off at uh, FedEx around like eight last night. Ran a wood not live. Now I'm getting up this morning. I got uh, I don't even know how many shoes I gotta do. But it is what it is, man. Let's get to it. Okay, y'all. So got the uh, hose drilled in them for the rope lace and stuff like that. Then on this one, it's gonna be a baseball theme. So I just went on and did the little line. And um, as you can see on this other one, I'm laying down a little stitching. Come on, focus, camera. I'm laying down a stitching right now, so. They're gonna turn out hard. It's a red socks thing, so y'all see how they come out. Take them out, eat it. Alright, y'all, so this is what we looking like. That junk kinda cold, I ain't gonna lie. I'm thinking I might do a whole shoe like this. It's gonna be very time consuming and tedious, but I feel like that'll be tough. Y'all let me know in the comments, man, if y'all think a whole shoe like this would be hard. On the stitching, like just do all the stitching. You know what I'm saying? The way I did this, I think it'll be tough. But anyway, let's keep on working. All right, y'all. So you know, I'm gonna take out this portion right here. Now I lay down the stencil for this side. We finna get going on this one. I'm not exactly sure on how I'm gonna do. Oh yeah, I put the numbers and stuff on the back too. I'm not exactly sure on how I'm gonna do it, but um, y'all to see how they turn out.
Alright y'all, so this is what we looking like right now. They just about finished. I really just gotta put the finisher on and then throw the rope laces in there. I really like them, man. They came out hard in my opinion. And mine is the only one that matters. No, I'm just playing. I think the dude gonna like these, man. They cold. You know what I'm saying? Like this, you know what I'm saying? Stuff like that, that. Two stars on that got red sock liner. And uh, I actually got a little surprise on the inside of the shoe for him. About to do the insoles and stuff like that. So I'll show y'all that. Real little understand my whole life. Don't know why they keep playing with my life. Young man get to live got his whole life. I don't got a plan for a nigga life. Just don't think you stop a kid. Can't let up, it's all on me. No, this ain't Monopoly. Welcome to reality. I can't keep playing. Can't keep playing. You can't keep playing. Can't keep playing. Hold it out your hand. I pulled the mission. Just don't think you stop a kid. Can't let up, it's all on me. No, this ain't Monopoly. Welcome to reality. I can't keep playing. Alright, man, this is gonna be the last playing. shoe for today. I dropped off the other pair already, uh, so. Last ones, I gotta go and box these up and uh take these up to FedEx real quick. Uh, that good kind of stuff is current at like eight o'clock, a little past eight or something like this. So, gonna go and take these up there, man. And yeah, it's, it's gonna end the day.